let me show you the TV stand that everyone in America has. Hello, happy Thursday. We just got back from uh, bringing the dog, uh, bringing, we went to, we, ugh, we went to go get the dog's medicine at her vet. Like we pick up a script and then we had to pick up meds. And then Arlo went to a chiropractor. I went to the thrift shop while she was in the chiropractor. And, um, you know, we stopped, we got some lunch and then we came home. I'm making a chicken Caesar salad tonight. And that's it. We have to go to CVS because this mousy brown hair that is happening here. Ooh, yeah. It is such an ugly fucking color. I don't even know what this is. Look at this. It is, it's ugly as fuck. There was a point in time when I had first dyed it from the purple that it was a nice color. But because this was originally a red color, I thought maybe the red wasn't going to come. Because I'm like, oh wow, it's brown. But then with washes and wearing, you know, wearing every day, the fucking red is showing its ugly ass face. And it's like orange red. And I ain't feeling it. So we are going to go to CVS, look around. Arlo's got some like coupons and stuff. She always has coupons. Um, you want a bottle of water? Coupons? Yes. Anyway, so um, she's going to, we're going to look around in there and then just come home. Um, she'll probably take a nap, to be honest with you. She's tired. I'm a little tired, but um, I can't nap during the day. That's just not who I am. Anyway, got some waters. You know, I found these waters in that purple. <laughs> when I picked it up the other day to move it, I'm like, what the fuck is in here? And then I go, oh, fuck, there's water. Hmm, cool. Anyway, so, oh, shit, I got to pick up Georgie's food. So we're going to go to CVS. Uh, we'll take you in the car, but you're not going in CVS. You're too big. CVS haul. Uh, we got some peanut butter uh, filled pretzels. Those are for Austin. I got myself these little nails here, here because my nails are jacked up. I, I don't know what the hell happened to them. So I'm going to put nails on them so I, they can stop snagging on things. Because I had gel nails on that I did myself, but I had them on for too long. Like... Every time I took a color off, I put a color on and I didn't give my nails enough time to breathe. So I jacked them up. So now I've got to cover them and just let them heal. So I'm going to put, these are like press-ons, but I'm also going to put them on with gel, with uh, glue so the fuckers don't come off. Um, this is for me. It's a blush stick. Whoops. It's a blush stick in the color. I have no fucking clue. Um, that's the color. Oh no, the color is, hold on. Floral majority. Okay, so right majority. Okay. Yes majority uh, So that's for me. This is for Samantha. It is a contour stick by wet and wilds Got that for her. These are also for her. She likes these some cotton rounds I can't stand the color of my hair and what it has become. It is too brassy. So we're going with a medium brown I got two because when that starts to fade I have a backup uh, I got more witch hazel uh, toner. I like using witch hazel as a toner. Some Colgate, two of those. A fruit and nut, Cadbury is my favorite candy bar. This is our favorite, um, what do you call it? Listerine, it's not strong and it's perfect. The zero alcohol cool mint, we got two of those. There was some kind of a something, some something Arlo had, T uh, coupon, whatever. Same thing with these things. Uh, and then these were $1.50, the orange Perrier, Perrier, Perry Perry. So we got all of those. I got some curl shampoo and conditioner, and then Georgie, some Temptations, and that is the CVS haul. I got shit happening here. Okay, so these are three slices of 647 um, Italian style bread. I'm making croutons. I just add some butter in a pan. I'll season this with a little bit of sea salt and like toss it around in a buttery pan and we've got croutons. I don't really like to put anything else on them because I don't know, I'm not a fan. I'm making our favorite 
Caesar dressing, and this is from, whoa, the Dairy Free Keto Cookbook. It's pretty much, we're not keto anymore, but let me tell you, this is probably the best shit I've ever had. So, wait a second. Ugh. Okay. So, I put it in here. I'm going, there's three anchovies in here. Um, and I never was one that liked uh, anchovies, like Caesar dressing with anchovies. But this is a fucking game changer. And it's the only Caesar dressing besides the Ken's bottled one, which is in a pinch. It's the only reason why we eat it. Because I'm too lazy to make this. But guess what I'm doing? Guess what I did? I made it. So we got that going on. I've got some chicken breasts that I, ch I chopped up and I'm marinating in a lot of seasoning. And then back here, I chopped up a shit ton of romaine, washed it, and it's just chilling. So we are having Caesar salads tonight. Very simple. Because, you know, yeah, no. I don't want anything too heavy. We had McDonald's. I know, McDonald's. I haven't eaten McDonald's in 20 years. But I wanted a fish filet sandwich and I got one. And it was delicious. Will I have another one in the next couple of days? Nope. Will I have one in the next couple of weeks? Probably not. Probably a couple of years. But it was fucking delicious. So I want something a little lighter for dinner. So this is why we're all having salad tonight. All right. Happy Friday. I've got a little Shoprite haul for you. It's very small. Or I'll just put the light on. So we got some bars for like a little snacky snack when we're hungry. These are the um, Robert Irvine. We like, I, I, I don't want to say Arlo's never tried them, but I like them. I've had the original one. I've never tried the other brand, like other flavors. This is a cookie dough, and then this is mint chocolate chip. So we got that. They were $1.50, by the way. Um, what is this? Coffee Mate, zero sugar, chocolate caramel. And then zero sugar. Oh, they're both zero sugar. Oh, cool. I thought I got one regular and one not, but they're both zero sugar. And then this one is the Central Perk. Um, I think it's hazelnut, right? Is it? Yep, hazelnut mocha. So we got coffee creamers. And then we uh, needed some body wash, so we got these two big Olay's, shea butter and original. Some 2% milk back there. We're having gluten-free pizza at my dad's tonight. So we got some cheese. And then we also just got cheese for the house because we don't have any mozzarella. Mm. Um, me and Arlo are on somewhat of like a yogurt kick with granola and stuff. So we got the Fit and Light and Fit Greek Peach. And then the Raspberry. And then I got the kids Chobani Flips. Two for Austin, two for Sam. Some Romaine. Romaine. And then these were $2.69 a piece. Obviously, there's just one for Sam and one for Austin. And then this is also for them over here. Just a Minute Maid Punch. These are only $1.69. So we've got two for them. Two and two. And then we got these Sumo oranges, which I've never had. And I'm going to try it in a few minutes. And some more green peppers for when we make fried rice and the piggies like green peppers. So that is what we got. Hello, I am going to do a, ta a taste test <sighs> on a sumo orange that I've never had before. So you guys know I like the Cara Cara oranges, but, or Cara Cara, whatever they're called. They're so good. But this is a sumo and it looks like a titty with a nipple. Sam, what do you think? Titty and a nipple? Look at the titty and the nipple. Sammy thinks so too. Titty and a nipple. So I hope it's easy to peel because I've got my, 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 it. no, it seems pretty easy to peel. I sort of just said, I hope it's easy to peel. I'm going to see. I hear it's very easy to peel these. Yes. Very easy. See, my nails are jacked because I told you guys, because I had gel on them for weeks and I didn't give them a chance to breathe. So then guess what happened? They're fucked up now. Okay. So, Ooh, it smells amazing. Smells really good. Oh yeah, they're so easy to peel. I mean, they come off in like one big hunk. Hunk of burning love. Anyway, so there's that. Okay, now, ooh baby. Let me put you guys down a little lower so you can actually fucking see me peel. Oh, now you can only see my double chin up. Cape May, New Jersey. I got this Why from the thrift shop. 
Huh? No, you're not even in it, Samantha. All right, so here we go. Let's see. Oh, baby! Are these better than Caracaras? Cars? Um, yeah. They're good. They're good. Yeah. The Cara Cara orange is a little bit better, only because they're a little sweeter. These remind me of like um orange juice. Um. Tangerine. Yeah, ish. You're not gonna keep eating mine. Here you go. Peel. Oh, Fucking here she is with her hand out. Bitch, I did all the work. Mmm. Does Jimmy want to try? I'll throw it. I'll throw it to you. No, I don't want it. I guess you don't like oranges. Anyway, I just wanted to try them on here. With you guys. Ugh, it looks like okay, so oh, yeah, do, do this is what happened today. Okay, so I think Dana told you that we were upgrading our, our TV stand because I had that since 2012. Yes, yeah. that long. Yes. I, I keep shit that long. We already know me. Yes. So I got this. TV stand on Amazon because the freebie guy, when he puts it on his telegram, you gotta run. You gotta go and get it because usually it's sold out. It's actually $10 cheaper now because he just reposted it. Anyway, Dana put it together while I was attempting to put the TV on the wall. And if you know me, like know me, know me, you know that things take forever. Because I have to have it just so. Have to. Because I have to make sure that it's on right. Have to. Because if this fucking bitch falls, have to. that's on me. Have to. I don't feel like paying another five hundred dollars for a fucking TV. But so right where the TV is, the studs are off center. So I had to figure that out. So there's actually a, a wood behind there, and then I had to. If you jump on this shit or if you hang on it, it ain't going nowhere. So Dana had put it on, on Instagram, right? That she's gonna build this thing. Please tell me why. 10 different people, so far, just 10, have already shown us this same exact TV stand. Oh, you have that? I have it too. Oh, you have that? I have it too. She's like, babe, this lady, she's got the same one. She's going through missing, babe. There's another fucking picture of the same fucking one. Babe, there's another picture. This other motherfucker has this same one. Does everybody else have our same living room too? Shit. Who else has this? Raise your fucking Raise hand, your hand the if you have this. I got it off Amazon. Wait, does my mother have this? No, your mother does not oh, have thank this. God. <laughs> okay, now along with that. My mother-in-law, they like this couch set, right? Yeah. So we sat on it, we're like, yo, that's really nice. Like they actually have a sectional. <laughs> so we just have a couch and the chase, right? The couch and the chase that uh, Wheezy is currently on. Don't mind my fatness. And is the table back here. Yeah, mom and pop have the same one. <laughs> Are we copying? Yes. Do we miss them? Absolutely. Of course, of course. Anyway, let me show you the TV stand that everyone in America has. Okay? <laughs> America's favorite TV stand. <laughs> let me show you. Mm hmm. Right. Right. Uh huh. If you still don't know what it looks like, hold on. Let me turn on the light for you. All right, here's a better look. Do you have this one? Does it look like this? Does it look like this? Does it have like the shelves like this? Please tell me. You know you have it. Raise your hand. 